So is Microsoft loop the notion killer? And the straight up answer is no. Let me tell you why. Before you come at me, I know it's still in preview and it hasn't officially released yet. As of now, you can only access it using your web browser. So what is this Microsoft loop? Well, it's a new productivity app from Microsoft, which is designed to help you work more collaboratively and efficiently. Loop combines the best of the Microsoft existing productivity apps such as OneNote, Teams, etc. With Loop, you can create and share interactive documents, notes, and tasks with others in real time. You can also embed Loop components in other Microsoft apps such as Outlook and Teams. But how is it different from Notion? Well, it is not. But before that, if you guys are new over here, hey guys, my name is Prithviraj. I'm an electronic music producer, a part-time gamer, and I also try to make videos. Well, when you take the first look at it, it's totally like a ripoff of Notion when it comes to the user interface. Just take a look at the two workspaces. If you ignore the external widgets that I have added on Notion, they are basically the same software. I got that clock and the calendar widgets from a third-party app. You can even add that cover picture and an emoji on top of the page, just like Notion. Credit where it's due though. The emoji look different so I'll give them that it works on the block mechanism just like notion every block is a different element you can use the forward slash command to add different workspaces like checklist number list and different kinds of headings just like notion database management is far better in notion as it gives you more options and if you're enjoying this video so far I'd really appreciate if you could hit that subscribe button that way we will also be able to stay in loop but the area where MS loop stands out the most is its ability to collaborate you can create and share interactive documents and notes and tasks with others in real time notion is also also a collaborative tool but if you compare it with loop it's not ideal for real-time collaborations you can easily mention your team members working on your project and they would be notified and also like I previously said if you have Microsoft 365 you can easily integrate with Microsoft Word teams etc it has this option called voting table this really looks cool to be honest since loop is designed keeping collaborations in mind then this voting table can really be useful I've been using loop for a while and I customize my workspaces based on that the advantage of it being similar to notion is that I didn't have to spend a lot of time figuring out the Interface. You can create pages and sub pages. One difference I found in sub pages is that if you click on the main page on Notion, you are able to see the sub pages as a list, and clicking on them will lead you to the particular page. But if you click on the main page on Loop, it opens up a blank page, and that really made me sad. One thing I really liked about Loop is that you can create completely different workspaces. When you open Loop, you'll be taken to this landing page. I have created different workspaces based on my different projects, and I will be honest, this thing actually turns out to be really helpful. It has this ideas page on top which is not linked with any of the existing pages. I guess you can use it as a random notepad to write down random notes. I have this page on Notion, I call it my scrapbook. I use it for the same purpose to note down my thoughts and the random things I come across. I plan on creating a video on how I manage my life using Notion. So if that's something that might interest you, then do let me know in the comments. I'm also gonna create a Obsidian video. And if you check out the project section I have created under loop, you will find out that's my next video. So make sure you're subscribed to my channel for that. Notion is a more customizable tool than Microsoft Loop. It has a wide variety of documents and databases. You can also customize the look and feel of your Notion workspace. Loop is less customizable as you can only select from the few templates it provides, but it's only a preview. So you can hope that it's gonna change soon when it's out everywhere. Also, as of now, Loop does not have a calendar view and that's something I really wished it had as I really use the Notion calendar. So let's address the burning question. Is it the Notion killer? Like I previously said, no, but it surely has the potential to become a great productivity app. So which tool is right for you? If you're looking for a collaborative tool that focused on real-time collaboration, and also if you are a member of the Microsoft 365 suit, then Microsoft Loop is a great option for you. If you are looking for a more customizable tool that integrates with wider range of apps, then definitely Notion is a better choice. If you are new into note taking and you have never used Notion before, then you can definitely give MS Loop a try since it is less overwhelming compared to Notion for beginners. If you want to know what my three favorite productivity apps are, then click here. Else if you want to know how you can use ChatGPT to stay more productive, click here. Thanks for watching and please consider liking this video and also subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you there. Yeah.